so I'm back with another video and I wanted to do a fall cool tone smoky eye I think that this is really simple guys you all will see how simple it is and you know smoky eyes can be done so many different ways there's a lot of different takes on it and um, if you all are a beauty enthusiast out there you all already know that this is just kind of my take on it and I thought it was really simple so I wanted to pop in here and show you all how I got it so with all that being said let's get into the video all right so we're gonna do a smoky smoky eye today but before but, you know, <laughs> I always get tongue tied but before we do we're going to moisturize and I'm going to use my beauty pie super healthy skin this is the ultimate anti-aging cream this is it right here um if you all haven't heard of beauty pie you should definitely check them out you can get luxury skincare products or any kind of beauty products for affordable prices and I will leave my video on it down below and I also put it in the cards so you can check it out it's definitely worth checking out to hear what it's all about but anyway this is the cream that I'm gonna use and because this is a smoky eye that's really simple <laughs> okay we're gonna start off with the eyes first okay and for my base i'm going to use this sephora foundation this is it right here and i'm just going to put a little little on the back of my hand and i'm going to just kind of put this all on my lid and i'm going to also carve out my brows only because you know we're going for that that extra glam look, that extra smoky look. We're, we're doing the most in this video. We're doing the most while doing the least. I like that. Doing the most while doing the least. <laughs> All right, so I'm back with the brows on and let's get this party started, y'all. We're gonna keep this simple. I'm going to use the Natasha Denona Glam Palette. So the shade that I'm going to put in my crease is Smoke. And that would be this shade right here. So I'm going to get a lot on my brush. And I'm just going to lightly apply it. Right here. And make sure whenever you're doing your smoky look. Or really any eyeshadow look. Try to get the softest brush that you have. The brush that I'm using now is just the BH Cosmetics brush. It's nothing special. And you don't want to apply a lot of pressure. You really don't need it. Just use a really light hand, almost as though you're kind of tickling your eye a little bit. And so as you can see, I'm just kind of buffing that out as much as possible and you don't need a lot. And what I'm also doing as opposed to like switching and getting a cleaner brush, I'm just gonna use a rag and just get off the extra shadow and just blend all of that out. Okay, so as you can see, I just kind of got it blown out. And that's just kind of the effect that you're wanting with a smoky eye. You don't wanna bring it all the way up to the top you know, start off with the lightest shade right there in the crease and just kind of blow it out. All right, so next on my lid, as well as deep in the crease, I'm going to I'm going to apply lash line. And to get that all applied, I'm going to just use a smudger brush, just a short smudger brush. This is another really cheap <laughs> brush. So we're just gonna apply this. And you all can just, will be able to see how easy a smoky eye is to do. Okay, and now that I have that applied, I'm going to go in with another brush and just kind of blend this out. But I'm gonna put some more of Lash Line on the brush and I'm just gonna smoke all of this out. And again, I do have my rag right here. 
and I'm just gonna continue to blend it out and go back and just kind of take more off on the rag and just continue to blend. And remember, you wanna keep a very light hand. Just kind of feels, it, it should feel like you're tickling your eye, like you barely feel it. All right, so the next step, I'm going to use this cream shadow. This is the Velvet Foil by Ame. And I'm just gonna use just a little bit of this. And I'm going to apply it with my finger. And I'm just gonna apply it right there on the lid. And this sets really fast, so you wanna go ahead and apply it and make sure you get it in place before it sets. And then I'm gonna go back one more time with lash line and I'm gonna apply that over that foil shadow. And then for our inner eye highlight, I'm gonna use inner corner. And I'm just gonna place that in the inner corner. Just like so. And then I'm gonna take a clean brush and just kind of blend that in a little bit. And that is it. That is it. I'm going to add some liner lashes and I'll do the other eye and then I'll be back. All right, so I'm back with the lashes on and liner and all that good stuff. So now I'm going to go in with my Too Faced Killer Liner in Smoke and I'm going to add this on my lower lash line. I'm gonna bring it in about halfway. Okay, and I think that I'm gonna leave the inner part. Um, I'm not sure, we're gonna wait and see. <laughs> I'm not sure how I wanna handle that part yet. So now I'm gonna go in with the foundation and I'm gonna use this Fenty foundation. This one right here. If I'm not mistaken, this is in shade 385. This is it right here. Okay, so we're just gonna go ahead and apply this very well all right so I got that applied and now I'm gonna go in with my bounce concealer by Beauty Blender And I'm just going to blend this up out. I'm gonna put a little up here as well. And then to get the inner part of the eye where the brush doesn't quite fit, I'm just gonna use like a pencil eyeshadow brush to just kind of blend that in. And for bronzer, I'm just going to use my cream bronzer by Fenty. The color that I have it in is chocolate. And I'm gonna try to be very light handed with this. And I always have to remind myself when I'm adding this bronzer to only add a little bit because a little bit goes a long way. All right, so let me go back over this with my sponge. All right, and now I'm going to use my Givenchy powder to set my under eye. And the powder that I'm gonna use all over my face is the Beauty Blender Bounce Powder in Nutmeg. I like this powder as well because ooh, it has an, a very nice blurring effect. And 
And for bronzer, powder bronzer, I'm gonna use my bronzer by Becca. I will have everything listed below with the names. And for highlighter, I'm just gonna use this Makeup Obsessions um, highlighter. The name of the palette is Committed. I don't even know if they sell this anymore, but I'm gonna use this shade right here. I'm gonna start off by putting it on my nose. See what it's looking like, yeah. I think I got this from Target or somewhere a while back. I'm gonna put a little up here. All right, and I think I'm gonna skip on blush. I'm gonna go back into the eyes. I'm gonna blend that out a little bit more. If I can find a brush, okay. Yeah. I'm just gonna see if I can smoke it out just a little bit more. I've got something right there. I can't see what it looks like. Something got on my, on my eye look. And for lips, I'm gonna keep it really, really simple. And I'm just gonna go in with a nude lippy by Makeup. Revolution. And let's see, I think that is it. That concludes the look. Let me know down in the comments what you think about this look. I'd love to hear about it. Thank you so much for tuning in and until my next video, smooches.